Yes, my hair looks like shit, but you know what? We're gonna do something about that right now, today. Yo, what is up everybody? I am Mama Yoshiko. Welcome to my channel if you're new here or welcome back to my channel, motherfucker. No, I have not washed my hair. And why have I not washed my hair? Because we are moments away from literal madness. It is quarantine time and I don't know, I'm fucking bored and stressed out. And what better way to freaking deal with the situation in the middle of quarantine than dye my fucking hair. As you see already by my hair, it is yellow. Unlike how it's kind of silvery-ish. So I did two days, not in a row, but every other day of about half a cup of lemon juice and then a quarter cup of like conditioner. And I think it took out the toner pretty good because I wanted a clean canvas when we do my hair. A while ago I asked you guys on my YouTube community tab on what color I should dye my hair. You all voted for purple. I'm dyeing the bottom half of my hair black just because I did hair modeling years ago and some of it is still bleached at the bottom. Sometimes it's freaking brown at the bottom of my hair. I don't know if anyone can tell. And then we got Arctic Fox purple, purple rain. And because I'm really gonna fuck myself over, I got a bleach kit. A bleach kit. Because I wanted to try to do my roots myself, and we will see how that goes. But I just look freaking crazy in bananas right now. But you only live once to have cool and exciting hair. And it is quarantine time. What better way to waste my time than do this shit? And we are gonna do this right now. So pack your shit, kids. Let's go. We're going to the bathroom. We're going to the bathroom. We're going. Let's go, everyone. Get your snacks. Grab the clothes, kids. Let's go. So we're dealing with the really shitty setup. I'm sorry about the echo, too. We are literally in the bathroom. This is the setup. This, you are on the freaking mirror is on my sink. The camera is on top of an Amazon box. There's a sheet on the floor so my grandma doesn't kill me and a backdrop. So I wasn't sure really how to go about this. Okay, disclaimer first. I'm not a hairstylist. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. But this is literally just the top layer of my hair I'm gonna be fucking with. So if it all goes to shambles, I'm okay with that. So first, we're gonna bleach my roots. Then I'm gonna debate if I want to take the chance and just bleach the rest. But I know this ain't the wisest decision, but like I said, if my hair breaks off, let it fall, bitch, I'm ready. But before we do that, what we're gonna do is first just separate this and see what that does. Also, I'm sorry if I'm looking, whoa, that is a scene look from like 2012. So I'm gonna be looking at this way a lot just cause the mirror is here. Oh my god, can you stop? Bitch, stop! Don't worry, don't worry about me. Just cringing at myself taking selfies like I'm in MySpace 2008. Don't mind me! So, I think I separated most of it. Yes, I know some parts are like still brown here. The parting is kind of difficult, as you see. Usually I will go through it and pick out the dark ones, but all my dark hair, I'm going to put in a scrunchie. So what I did was I decided to do two different applications. I used like a little bit of the bleach, one part bleach, two, three parts developer. I don't fucking know what I did. And then I kind of just estimated how much I would use for my roots. Because if you mix everything and it dries, you can't use it. So I just mixed enough that would be enough for my roots. And then I saved and mixed everything after for the rest of my hair. I'm not a professional, don't listen to me. Sorry there's a lot of voiceover. I'm an idiot and I left the fan on. This is kind of where I fucked up. I did my roots and then I noticed I got a shit ton of it in my already bleached hair before I was gonna second bleach it. Um, fuck my life right now. I can already feel that I got it here and I'm like, fuck. I mean, it's okay. I already made the freaking thing in my head. If I lose any hair, oh fucking well. Oh no, it's on my pants. Don't really care if I lose any hair but we're gonna leave this on for like 30 40 minutes it said and i'll see y'all on the flip side deuces so it's been about 20 holy shit 
Yeah, see? This part, my, it would suck if my bangs broke off. It hasn't yet, but as you see, I don't think I coated it enough. As you see, it's orange, which is fine. Cause at the end of this, I'm just gonna freaking dump purple on it. So, it's Gucci. I have another 20 minutes, so let's see what happens. So it's been about 50 minutes. Yes, it is very orange and yes, I got overlap, but I'm gonna go wash the shit off before um, my hair falls out. Bye. As you can see, my roots are very orange. So my plan right now is to blow dry this and do a bleach bath. I'm gonna keep away from like this area because this might where it all goes downhill but my ends are very dark and still very gray so let's see how that goes so i'm gonna just show how i'm going about doing the rest of my hair i forgot i had bleach on this comb oh hooray so what i'm first doing is getting like my comb and going like this and i'm gonna be careful for where i just did it no I am not a professional. It's quarantine time and I'm bored. And I've never dyed my hair before, like on my own. I'm gonna just half it and just swirl it in there. Like, I don't know what I'm doing. So I think it's coated. So I'm just gonna just fold it very carefully. Fold it in half and then let it bake. And as I said before, I am not a hairstylist. I don't know what I'm doing, but it's quarantine time, so why not be wild? I look good, I look flat. I don't know. It wasn't until I became an adult, yes, I'm an adult, where I'm like, I'm gonna start doing shit to myself be cautious to avoid breakage even though I'm, I know I'm probably gonna get breakage but I'm just doing the roots and then like this bottom half of my hair that's like still gray I do that I have no clue if I'm doing anything right but I'm gonna foil that I look like a tin man gonna leave it on for a bit but if you can see my roots look white this is about 20 minutes in so ugh. and this is where shit hits the absolute fan i got bleach all over my face and on my eyelashes and oh, my eyeballs i got bleach in my face and then i washed it off so everything was gucci see this is all pretty blonde to me let's see if there's any casualties not yet thank god it looks bad but i'm gonna first get it off my face and let's rinse this shit off i am very surprised that i have no breakage none yeah holy crap 20 minutes was a safe call I'm just lightly combing just to like get my part going. One strand. Wow. I think the trick is to just be careful. I don't know. Cause believe me, I've watched so many Brad Mondo videos before doing this to make sure I didn't end up fucking my hair. And I'm surprised. I literally lose more than that when I take a shower. My shirt is like done for. So I'm gonna go back and use the gloves <laughs> that I just used for the bleach. Why? I don't know. It just seemed right. And I don't have any other gloves. Literally quarantine. I've used up all of my gloves. So I'm just gonna wash them. I don't even know if that does anything. But why not try to be a little cautious? I don't know if there really is a point to use a bowl or should I just dab it on my head? But here is Arctic Fox Purple Rain. Purple Rain! Purple Rain! I don't know what I'm doing. That is, that is purple. Get out! Get out of me! 
thing right now. It's the end of you. What the fuck? There you go. Ooh, that is purple. Let's start this madness. Holy shit. Holy crap, that's so purple. Aw oh, man, I was gonna like split it first. Whoops. Should I just mush it in? I don't know what I'm doing. I know I should have freaking split it apart first, but I was too excited. I was too excited to go on with the purple. This is cool. Whoa, Nelly. My face is gonna be purple. I just spilled a huge clump of it on the floor. <laughs> Grandma, I'm sorry. I saved it. That is so purple, holy crap. This is gonna be very uneven. I am too lazy to separate at this point. This is the vibe. I'ma still go back and try to do it. See, I was honestly really surprised that like purple one, but then when I saw the reasons why, y'all don't fucking surprise me. Really, Ponta boy? And then Kanathal. After I saw that, I was like, I'm not surprised y'all freakers picked purple. Me. I'm not gonna lie though, this stuff smells good. It smells like actual grape. <laughs> I just got it in my nose. I mean, it smells good, but it's still up my nose. Now to do the other side. Wow. I look good. I look flat. I look good. I look good. A question for my old people. <laughs> I'm kidding, no one's old in these streets. But like, I notice basically, who else is going through a quarter life crisis? Cause I am. As soon as I graduated from high school and like started uni and stuff, I started like getting like five ten ear piercings. Now I'm dyeing my hair in my bathroom from not leaving the house in a week. Hooray! I'm just doing my freaking top. Y'all were like, you would look so cool in purple and I'm just like, ooh. Not gonna lie, a part of me wanted red to win, but that's just cause everything in my life is red. But like, I'm feeling this purple though. When you try to figure out how to turn off your camera. So I think I'm about done coating this. So now that my purple is done, now I'm gonna go in with the bottom half of my hair with Transylvania Black. And I'm just gonna fucking gloop it on cause I don't give a fuck really. I will section it at least. Boom, done. See, now you can see the brown, but this is a look. That is blacker than my soul. Let's get to it. Wow, it's blending in with the screen and everything. Ooh, beautiful black. Oh, I missed having black hair. Oh my god, I am literally- I am a mess everywhere. This was a bad idea, but the best idea. I probably should have brushed my hair before this too. Ooh. I am literally and totally a mess. Well, that's done. Should I care about the ink on my face? Nah, not today. I'm gonna go leave this on and I'm gonna clean the bathroom before my people kill me. And then I'm gonna wash all this off and then the grand reveal. Deuces. And ta-da! Yo, I am feeling myself. It is the next day because I was literally filming this at like 3 a.m. So I took a shower and went to bed. And here is the result. I'm actually really happy with how it turned out. But yo, thank you all for choosing purple. I am Ponta Boy. I am Kokichi. I might freaking keep this for a while. I have never dyed my hair myself. I've never had that impulse. I've cut my hair. I've gotten like 10 piercings in my ears, but I've never fucked with my hair on my own. But I am so happy I did it. Quarantine time is the best way to freaking fuck up your life. I'm kidding, don't fuck up your life. Fuck up things that aren't that deep. Fuck up things, I don't know, 
fuck up what you want, I guess. But I am officially Panta Boy. And when this fades, maybe I'ma look like Kanato. At first, my original plan was to just dye it, let it fade, and freaking have my Hataharu hair again. But I'm like, yo, I might experiment with hair colors in the future. I just wanna have anime girl hair or boy. Obviously, it is not as dark as our freaking Panta boy. So yeah, this video is not to condone you to just buy a bunch of shit, do your hair yourself. I am not a hairstylist, but I am honestly so surprised I had no breakage. Cause I was so prepared for my hair to fucking fall out. I was so ready because I know my hair was previously bleached before and I knew and I didn't even end up putting the shampoo in at the end. I just put the straight up bleach in my hair. I was full on ready for breakage and I had none, still none. Fucking fuck me up fam. But this was fun. This was like pretty, this was pretty liberating for me. And I think it looks pretty cute. It's cute or whatever. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this freaking I dye my hair during quarantine. And thank you all for voting for freaking purple. I still can't believe it. 60% what the freak guys. But um yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments and I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for joining my weeb family. I love you very much and I'll see you next time. Bye.